Hi kids! Today we will learn how we can find the parameter and area of rectangle and square. So let's get started. Parameter Kids, parameter is the distance or the length of boundary of a figure. Today we will learn finding the parameter of rectangle and square. Here we have a square with its side given. Its side measures 5 centimeters. We have to find its parameter, that is, the length of the boundary of the square. If the side is given, we can find the parameter using the formula. Parameter equals 4 multiplied with side. Here, side is 5 centimeters, so parameter is 4 multiplied with 5. 4 multiplied with 5 equals 20, so parameter is 20 centimeters. Now, let's take another example. Here we have a square with side 3 centimeters. Let's find its parameter. We know parameter equals 4 multiplied with side. And here the side is 3 centimeters. So parameter equals 4 multiplied with 3 equals 12 centimeters. Now let's move to another question. Here we have a square with parameter 36 centimeters and we have to find the length of its side. We are given with the parameter and we have to find its side. We know parameter is 4 multiplied with side. Filling the value of parameter, we get 36 equals 4 multiplied by side. We have to solve this equation, or we can think like multiply 4 with which number, so that it gives us 36. If we multiply 4 with 9, we get 36. So here, side equals 9. So side of the square is 9 centimeters. We can also solve it the equation way. Keeping s on the right hand side, we can shift 4 on the right hand side and change its sign. Like here, it's getting multiplied. So on right hand, it will be divided. So s equals 36 divided by 4. And 36 divided by 4 we get 9. So side equals 9 centimeters. Here, let's solve a few questions in a quick fashion. Parameter of square with side 5 centimeters will be 5 multiplied by 4 equals 20 centimeters. Parameter of square with side 3 centimeters will be 4 multiplied by 3 equals 12 centimeters. Side of the square with parameter 20 centimeters will be 20 divided by 4 equals 5 centimeters. Side of the square with parameter 40 centimeters will be 40 divided by 4 equals 10 centimeters. Now let's learn how we find area of square. Here we have a square with its side mentioned. It is 5 centimeters. Formula for finding area of a square is side square or side multiplied by side. So area of this square equals 5 multiplied by 5 equals 25 centimeters square. As R is always mentioned, 
in square unit. Here we have another square. Its side is 4 centimeters. Let's find its area. The area of square is side square, or side multiplied by side. So, 4 multiplied by 4 equals 16. So, area of this square equals 16 centimeters square. Now, let's solve a quick question in a quick fashion. Area of square with side 5 centimeters will be 5 multiplied by 5 equals 25 centimeters square. Area of square with side 3 centimeters will be 3 multiplied by 3 equals 9 centimeters square. Now let's learn finding area and parameter of rhombus. This is a rhombus shape. Rhombus also have all sides equal. So finding parameter and area of rhombus is just same as we did for square. Parameter of rhombus with side 8 centimeters will be 8 multiplied by 4. 8 multiplied by 4 equals 32 centimeters. So parameter of rhombus with side 8 centimeters is 32 centimeters. Area of rhombus with side 4 will be 4 multiplied by 4 equals centimeters square. So kids, finding area and parameter in case of a rhombus is same as we find in a square. Now let's learn finding parameter of a rectangle. We know rectangle also have four squares, but its all sides are not equal. Its opposites are equal. Two of its opposite sides are smaller than other two sides. Here we have a rectangle with its length and breadth mentioned. Let's find its parameter. Here the length of this rectangle is 7 centimeters and the breadth of this rectangle is 3 centimeters. Now let's find its parameter. Formula to find the parameter in case of a rectangle is 2 times length plus breadth. That is 2 multiplied with the sum of length of breadth. Here, length is 7 centimeters, breadth is 3 centimeters. Putting the values we get, 2 multiplied by 7 plus 3, 2 multiplied by 10, 2 multiplied by 10 equals 20 centimeters. So, parameter of this rectangle is 20 centimeters. Now let's take another example. Here we have another rectangle with its length and breadth mentioned. Length is 5 centimeters. Breadth is 4 centimeters. Now let's find its parameter. We know parameter is 2 multiplied by the sum of length and breadth. So putting the values of length and breadth in formula, perimeter equals 2 multiplied by 5 plus 4. Perimeter equals 2 multiplied by 9. So perimeter equals 18 centimeters. Now let's learn how to find the area of rectangle. Here we have a rectangle. Let's find its area. Formula to find the area of a rectangle is very simple. Just multiply length with breadth. Length multiplied by breadth. So area of rectangle is a product of its length and breadth. So putting the value we get, area equals 7 multiplied by 3. Area equals 21 centimeters square. 
Remember, area is always mentioned in square units. Now let's solve a few questions on based of what we learned. What will be the area of rectangle with breadth 5 centimeters and length 9 centimeters? We know area of rectangle is length multiplied by breadth. And length and breadth are 9 multiplied by 5 centimeters. So area equals 45 centimeters square. Now let's solve another question. Find the length of a given rectangle having area as 195 meters square and breadth 13 meters. We know length multiplied by breadth equals area. Putting the values, we will get length multiplied by 13 equals 195. Breadth is 13 centimeters and area is 195 centimeters square. So we have this in the form of a mathematical equation. Solving this mathematical equation, we get length equals 195 divided by 13. 195 divided by 13 is 15. So length is 15 centimeters. Now let's solve another question. How would you find the difference between the perimeter and area of the rectangle measuring 8 meters by 4 meters? We have to find the difference between perimeter and area. So first, we have to find the perimeter and area of this rectangle. So putting the values we get, perimeter equals 2 multiplied with the sum of 8 and 4. So we get 2 multiplied with 12. That is 24 centimeters. So we got the perimeter. Now, let's find the area. We know area of a rectangle is length multiplied with breadth. Putting the values, we get 8 multiplied with 4 equals 32 centimeters square. So we got the area 2. Now, we have to find the difference between the area and the perimeter. And we know we subtract the smaller thing from the bigger thing. Here, the bigger one is area. So let's subtract the perimeter from area. Area is 32 centimeters square. And perimeter is 24 centimeters. 32 minus 24 equals 8 centimeters. So difference between area and perimeter of this rectangle is 8 centimeters. Now let's solve another question. Here we have a grid where each cell is of measure 1 centimeter by 1 centimeter or each small square has side 1 centimeter we have to find how many cells in rows and columns together would make a square of perimeter 20 centimeters. First, let's try to understand the question. We have to find how many cells in rows and columns would make a square of perimeter 20 centimeters. Perimeter 20 centimeters means side multiplied by 4 equals 20 centimeters. First of all, find the side of the square whose perimeter is 20 centimeters. So side of square would be 20 divided by 4 equals 5 centimeters. So a square with side 5 centimeters will have perimeter 20 centimeters. So we have to find the square with side 5 centimeters. 
This is the grid with side 5 cm, as each square has side 1 cm. So 5 squares will make a side 5 cm. This square is made up of 25 squares. So our answer is 25 squares. Let's answer another question. The length and breadth of the rectangle is given below in the figure. Find the cost of fencing on the boundary at the rate of $12 per centimeter. We have to find the cost of fencing on boundary. So, first we need to find the parameter of this rectangle. And we know parameter is 2 times the sum of length plus breadth. 2 multiplied by 7 plus 4 equals 2 multiplied by 11 equals 22 centimeters. So the parameter of this rectangle is 22 centimeters. And we are given cost of fencing the boundary is $12 per centimeter. And we have to find the cost of fencing 22 centimeters. We will multiply 22 with 12 to get the cost of fencing 22 centimeters. As the boundary is 22 centimeters long, cost of fencing 1 centimeter is $12. So cost of fencing 22 centimeters will be 12 multiplied by 22 equals $264. So kids, let's revise what we have learned. We have learned parameter of square is 4 times the side. Parameter of rectangle is 2 times length plus breadth. Area of square is side square or side multiplied by side. Area of rectangle is length times the breadth, that is, and in case of a rhombus and square, it's same as a square. So kids, now you may go ahead and take a quiz to learn more. Bye-bye! Tootway has thousands of animated videos on math, English, and science to clear the core basics of these subjects.